how blue my eyes are. Ha. <laughs> so hey guys, I'm Alex and I'm I'm not awake yet. I don't really have a life, so I decided I'm going to start making vlogs. And I can't think of a better way to introduce myself to you than to give you a top 10 crazy weird ridiculous facts about Alex. Go. Number 1. I have 8 tattoos and I got my first ones in the back of a sex shop, which happened to be right next door to a strip club. Oh, and I brought my mother with me. <laughs> That's the kind of thing that happens when you want a tattoo but aren't of legal age to get one. You go through some pretty sketchy situations to get what you want. You should probably just wait till you're 18. Alright, number two. My middle name is Lynn, and I was named after the nurse who delivered me. And this is interesting because Nurse Lynn was the only person assisting my mom with delivering me that day. Apparently my dad and my doctor were watching a football game at the time. Congratulations, sir. It's a little girl. Oh my god. A baby girl. I'm so happy we're a touchdown. Whoa! You're Way to go, guys. Alright, number three. I can dislocate my right kneecap. So in between grade 7 and grade 9, I got in a series of accidents. The first one kind of tore two of the main tendons in my knee, and then the second one just shattered the f***ing kneecap altogether. And I've had surgery and all that lovely stuff, but still, if I take my foot and move it to the left and downward a bit, I can move that f***ing places it ain't supposed to be. And you'll know when I do it, because I'll be on the ground going, OH GOD WHY?! Number four. I am completely paranoid before I'm about to go to sleep. When I was a kid, I was just extremely impressionable, so if I thought something was scary, it would stick with me. So that scene when the grudge comes up from underneath the blanket and gets the chick, yeah, I have to sleep like this now. Because that dead chick's gonna come up and kill me if I don't. Or after watching the mummy movies, I couldn't sleep without a cat in the room. Cats are the guardians of the underworld. He will fear them until he's fully regenerated. And then he will fear nothing! Ugh. 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 Emo. Alright, number five. I have dyed my hair every single color of the rainbow except for gray. Which sucks, because coloring my hair is like one of my pastimes. And not being able to get it to a certain color is like needing that one rare holographic Pokemon card. Trying forever to find this one card and finally thinking you found it. Holding it for a split second, thinking you'll be together forever. And then your little brother puts it in his mouth and spits it out of your feet. And your life is ruined. Number six, I know more about the RMS Titanic than any other 21 year old in the world and I will gladly test that. But it's great because like inside this brain there's a little treasure chest in there with vast amounts of historical knowledge about a real event and it makes me so proud of myself that I actually learned something in school. Seven, yeah, I have a full motorcycle license but no car license. But I'm from a really small town, so when I got that license, the DMV office really didn't know what to do. They'd never issued a license like that before. They tried to turn me away saying, Uh, we can't issue this cause, like, come back in six months. I go home and tell my dad that they're stupid, and my dad's like six foot two and big and pretty menacing when he wants to be, so he marches in there and five minutes later I have my license. Ooh, number... Eight. Does that look like an eight? Sort of. My worst fear is corpses. So if a zombie outbreak ever occurs, you might as well just shoot me in the face. I am going to be useless and a very big liability to your survival. Alright, number nine. I'm an only child, but I consider myself to have two half-adopted sisters. I'm in no way related to either of them, but they grew up in my family and were a giant part of my childhood, so I consider them to be, like, blood so you two know who you are, and I want you guys to know I'm always going to love you, and you're always going to be my sisters. I love you guys. And finally, number 10. I'm allergic to milk, and I f***ing hate it. So what I end up doing is I just cheat constantly on my allergy and just eat whatever the hell I want. And if you're watching this and you have an allergy, don't do what I'm doing. My allergy is fatal, yours could be, and I don't want you to die. Well, crazy people, that was my top 10 crazy, weird, ridiculous facts about myself. And if you get anything weirder than what I just said, I, I want to hear about it. Tell me more about you. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to be vlogging and doing stuff like this for a while. So I'll see you guys again soon. Goodbye.